Hello guys, welcome back to another tutorial, and today I'm going to show you how to install mods on your new Minecraft launcher and new Minecraft folder thingy, because uh, Minecraft has released a new, well Mojang has released a new Minecraft launcher and it looks way more different, so I'm just going to run this Minecraft launcher, and this is pretty much what it looks like. So why am I going to show you how to install mods? Um, it is more different than before. So everything has changed and there's a new way to install mods. It's almost like before but you have to change a bit more stuff. It's not that simple now. So as you can see right here I have a lot of random stuff here. I don't really have to talk about it in this video because today I'm just going to show you how to install mods. So the first thing you want to know is you want to make sure that your mod is on the right version. Imagine you're going to run your Minecraft on 1.6 version. You want to make sure that the version of your mod is 1.6 also. Because if it's 1.5.2, it will not work. Something will be wrong and you will not be able to launch your Minecraft uh, like usually. So today I'm going to show you how to install Optifine 1.5.2 just because the 1.6.1 isn't out yet. So once it's out, um, you just have to pretty much do the same thing that I'm doing in this video, but for another folder. So what you want to do is just download that Optifine um, 1.5.2. So let's just wait until this ad. I can skip this ad to download it. So right like that, and I'm just going to download this. And as you can see, it's been downloading. Whoa! Okay, sorry about that random little noise. I hate these pop-up pop ads. It's really random and stupid. But anyways, once you're done, you can just exit out of everything. And now it's the hard part. First, you want to go onto the Start menu and go to the Search Programs and File. And you want to type in, um, oops, percent app data percent as usually. You want to go into dot Minecraft, but this time you don't want to go into the bin and the Minecraft jar. You want to go into the versions. So it's way more different. Um, if you want to have the 1.5.2 version. Um, um, if you want like 1.5.2 Optifine, you want to make sure you once you go into this Minecraft launcher, you want to launch uh, at least one profile with the 1.5.2. So you just want to go like so. This is my profile, 1.5.2 profile, and as you can see, you have the 1.5.2 version. You want to at least run it once. So once you have run it once, you want to go into your versions as like I did before and as you can see there's the 1.5.2 what you want to do is just copy paste it so control C and then control V or maybe different in the Mac but yeah and then you want to change this name to something different so imagine I want 1.5.2 M uh, oops M why M because just modded I guess so once you're done uh, you just want to go over here and rename it to that then you want to press F2 again and just copy that, Control C again. And you want to paste that in each of these. So you want to change all of these files, the JSON file and the JAR file, to the same name you have the folder named. After that, you want to go into the JSON file and go to Edit with Notepad. So right here, you should have ID uh, or something like that. Um, now I'm using Notepad++. It's a bit different, but it's I don't think it's too much different than Notepad. You just want to find that ID place and just paste that again and change the name to the thing you named the folder. And then you want to save that and just exit out. So once you're done with that, you just want to do the usual thing you usually do. Um, you can go to your downloads folder. So I'm just going to drag this a bit here. And as you can see, I already have that Optifine. Um, I already tested this once just to like make sure it works. So you just want to open up that Optifine, and I'm going to minimize it a bit, just so you, get, you guys could see. What you want to do is, you want to install WinRAR, because, or 7.zip, or something like that, just so you can edit this, uh, this .jar file. So you just want to edit with WinRAR. Let me just like minimize this again, just to show you guys what it looks like. And just like this. So once you're done, you want to do as you did before. You want to delete meta ins. So get out of here, meta ins. This will like, I'm not so sure what it meta ins does, but you just want to delete it. Make sure you delete it. Then uh, you just want to select all this. So Control A to select all. Control and take out this one because this one is like useless. 
and you want to drag all these files into here. Press OK, and you're pretty much done. Just exit out, exit out. So I have Optifine right now, and I'm just going to show you and prove to you that it actually works if I go to the Minecraft launcher. So um, as you can see, I'm going to go into this. So uh, once you're done, you want to make sure once you you want you, if you want you can create a new profile but I'm just gonna use this 1.5.2 profile you wanna edit profile and you wanna enable well well you don't have to enable snapshots I guess but you wanna go into use versions and you wanna click this drop down window and find the folder you had it so release 1.5.2 M you wanna make sure you have found your renamed folder and just save your profile and you can pretty much run it so once you run it, um, just open up your Minecraft. I have I have Faithful. Faithful looks way better, so I'm gonna put on Faithful. And to prove to you, I have Optifine. Let me just go into Video Settings. As you can see right here, I have this awesome Optifine thingy right here, where I can like scroll everything. We'll have this sort of bar, and I have the details, animation. So everything works. Optifine works and I'm gonna just go into creative uh, well one of my worlds and as you can see a new Optifine version just control and as you can see I have the zoom in effect pretty awesome and Optifine works so um, just another note to make sure that everything works as I said in the beginning I know I said this a bunch of times but you want to make sure that the version uh, well the version of the mod is the version that you're playing on. So if you're playing on 1.6 of 1.6.1 of Optifine, oh, well, Minecraft, okay, I'm just mixing up my words now. You want to have 1.5, uh, 1.6.1 Optifine. You want to make sure all that is right because if it's not the right one, if it's not the full official Optifine 1.6.1, it will not work. Uh, it's something more different. I can actually prove you that it's a bit different. So let me just go back to there. It, this is just like a extra thing to make you guys notice. So as you can see right here, if I go to the 1.5.2 and look at the jar file, as you can see, there's all this achievement and random stuff all here, all these folders. But if I go into this 1.6.1 and go into this Minecraft, uh, well, this jar. As you can see, you have less folders, so it's a bit more different. They changed a bit, like the versions, um, the folders are different. They stored it somewhere else. I'm not so sure where exactly, but yeah. So that's about it for this video. Hope this helps you. If you have any problems, just comment down in the description down below, and make sure it's the most detailed comment as possible. Cause if you don't tell me something really detailed and you just say, "Oh, it doesn't work," then I can't really help you because I don't know what's your problem. So anyways, guys, that's about it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you understood some more stuff. Hope you know how to do this right now. And yeah, I'll see you later, guys. Thanks so much for watching.